हेलो बच्चो लेट्स रीड दिस क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन इज डू यू थिंक कूलम्स लॉ इज इन अकॉर्डेंस विद न्यूटन थर्ड लॉ ऑफ मोशन इन दिस क्वेश्चन द की कॉन्सेप्ट इज न्यूटन थर्ड लॉ ऑफ मोशन एंड कूलम्स लॉ According to Newton's third law of motion, for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. Newton's third law of motion can also be written as that ki if a body A exerts a force f on another body b then this body b exerts a force minus f on a is isme minus f vector is showing the direction बिकॉज हमने डाउनवर्ड मोशन को पॉजिटिव कंसिडर किया है सो द बॉडी बी विल एक्सर्ट अ फोर्स एफ वेक्टर इन ऑपोजिट डायरेक्शन दैट इज अपवर्ड एंड इट विल बी नेगेटिव नाउ फॉर कूलम्स लॉ फोर्स इज गिवन एज के क्यू वन क्यू टू अपॉन आर स्क्वेर suppose there are two charges q1 and q2 they are r distance apart so q2 pe force due to q1 will be in positive x direction that will be equal to force on 2 due to 1 and force on charge q due to force on charge q1 due to q2 will be equal to f12 and will be in negative x direction so force on 1 due to 2 will be equal to force on 2 due to 1 and the magnitude will be same that is k q1 q2 upon r square since their magnitude are same and the direction is opposite which is in accordance with newton's third law of motion jo ki kehta hai ki if a body a exerts a force f on another body b then b exerts a force minus f vector on a same is the case with coulomb's law jisme force exerted by two charges on each other are equal and opposite in direction therefore yes the coulomb's law is in accordance with newton's third law of motion hope you understood this well best of luck